Hi everyone and welcome. Uh, today I'm continuing to read the book uh, Prosperity Consciousness by Stephen Chuti Saboman. If you're watching the replay, type in hashtag replay in the comments below. One uh, a fun, uh, fun question for you. What is your favorite fruit? Mine is orange right now. It's like I can eat so many oranges throughout the day, you know. So like yesterday we were, um, you know, in the desert and I saw this uh, car selling oranges and those were those tiny little oranges and I was like in orange heaven. So let me know what is your favorite fruit and let's continue to read the book Prosperity Consciousness. So today I'm reading from page number 14 and we've been talking about what are you unwilling to receive. So here's a practical process for you. An important step in cultivating the willingness to receive everything without judgment is developing the willingness to claim and own the capacity to receive even though you may have no idea what that means or what will be coming to you. So that's more important, you know, because a lot of us, we don't even know what that means, you know. A key part of being willing to receive everything is to stop resisting and reacting to any interaction you or anyone else has. So when you catch yourself resisting and reacting, ask yourself the following questions. What am I unwilling to receive here? What am I unwilling to receive here? What ideas or viewpoints have I created that are stopping me from receiving? Hey Palak, good to have you live. These ideas and viewpoints may seem meaningful, significant or even sacred to you. It may be challenging for you to actually look at them. What would it be like to receive from everybody without judgment? And what would it be like to receive from everybody without any point of view? Having a point of view can be a judgment and largely automatic and unconscious. So let me read these four questions again for you. What am I unwilling to receive here? What ideas or viewpoints have I created that are stopping me from receiving? What would it be like to receive from everybody without judgment? And what would it be like to receive from everybody without any point of view? Like, do you have uh, those people in your life whom you totally uh, are allergic to or people whom you have very strong points of views about like I can't stand this person or I detest this person or whatever so when you have these really strong points of views about people can you receive from them can you receive from them you cannot you absolutely cannot because when you have these strong points of views, you shut off your receiving from these people. So playing around with these questions really will open up a lot of places where you have shut off your receiving. Let me read them again. What am I unwilling to receive here? What ideas or viewpoints have I created that are stopping me from receiving? What would it be like to receive from everybody without judgment? And what would it be like to receive from everybody without any point of view? So, uh, you know, play with these questions throughout the day and post your insights in the comments below. And if you've been enjoying this book reading, please invite other people to the group. The link is in the description and I will see you in another Facebook Live tomorrow. Bye.